requested, but there's UFO equipment. See? These goggles, there's some sort of aura filter. There's an energy emission right behind him there in the woods. That's the clearing with the gas lamp, where bed disappeared. We need to know more about those gas lamps. Someone should go back and talk to that town archivist. Oh, it should uh, probably uh, be me. I can, I can. I'll no, take you want to take No, me? I'll go, I'll go. Sure, yeah. I can come help. You guys keep seat. Want me to send Joe? No, no, no. Uh, no. Okay. He's got it. Hello. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> Well, this is a hell of an archive you got here for a small town. Ah, well, you know small towns. God help you if you ever throw anything away. Yeah, well... <laughs> help you, Mr. Ma'am? Please tell me you've taken that first man. Ah, me? No, I've never left town. Really? Yeah. Family obligations. <laughs> well, family ain't easy. No, it ain't. Never even been down the highway to New York City. I... You travel? Well, I got a new job. Gets me out a little bit. Okay. Up until a couple months ago, though, I'd never been more than a tank of gas away from my parents' front porch unless I was digging ditches out somewhere. So what it is about the gas lamps? You don't want to bring Paris here. You want to make you feel like you're there. Don't get me wrong. It's a nice town, just... I've got a whole warehouse full of memories of this place. It'd sure be nice to have at least one wall memories of somewhere else. Anything else? No, I know what you mean. Like, uh, not having a story that doesn't start off. You remember that night at Jimmy's bar? Or, remember that waitress? Oh, yeah, you remember her, because we go to that diner every weekend. You remember what happened at the town barbecue? Oh, which one? That one? No, the other one. That one? No, the other one. Yeah. It just, hey. <laughs> yeah, just once, I want to be able to say, remember that waiter? That little cafe off Pont Neuf. Remember when the car broke down in Moscow? What was the name of that hotel we stayed at in Athens? Remember the view from the Eiffel Tower? It was raining, but the lights made everything glow. Helen, I, uh, I don't have quite the imagination you do. <laughs> no, I, uh, I made my choices, and, uh, well, I can't pretend otherwise, so. <laughs> Sorry, I, this just must seem pretty silly. I didn't... No, no, no. I just, uh, I oh. can't. <laughs> okay. But this is the, the reason I came is because, uh, we have some uh, surveying equipment that picked up some weird readings off one of your gas lamps in the forest. Show me. Uh, well, if actually, if I could just see, can I see some plans? Uh, my, my town, my, my yes. archives. Show me. Um, well, just, uh, thanks. Hey, Mabel, you remember Cassandra? This is Jenkins, it's Ezekiel. You brought someone who is not a librarian to here? Yay. Um, so this is just how you found it? Bed slammed the bloke into it and then poof. Poof? <laughs> Someone went poof? No, that's no, what, that's a figure of speech. He's Australian. We, we don't even know what he's singing half the time. Do you have any idea what this is doing out here in the middle of the woods? No. I've, I've never seen this one. Well, so far, it seems pretty... <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Optical illusion. Optical illusion? No, that was Colonel Baird. Uh, d d d d you're, you're right, it was an optical illusion. Uh, that, that's what we call them in Australia. Colonel beds, you know. Oi, sun in my eyes. Thought I, thought I saw a Colonel bed. <laughs> oh, wow. You really don't expect me to buy that, do you? I don't know. Maybe. Well, it, that's actually worked before. Yeah, it does. It's weird. Okay. You're not librarians. Well, no, actually, we are. Mostly. But I really need you to trust me. Okay, I need you not to say anything to anyone else in town about this. Look, if something's going on in my town, I need to know about it. And I promise you, I promise I'll tell you everything I know. I really need you to go back to the archives right now and dig up anything on these gas lamps. Do not hold out on me. <laughs> 